Israel or Pentis. Welcome to tonight's stream. How are you doing? Um, yeah, we're in a 37. Um, this is a service that I started during the week somewhere. And um, it, it takes about 15 minutes in between when I finish this service to start the other service. So we're just going to hang about here. That gives me enough time that I don't have to pause it. Then I can actually get stuff sorted on here, get links up and everything, in theory. He says, so, hey, welcome to the stream. Um, what have we got in store for tonight then? Um, I don't know. <laughs> um, because according to Train Sim World, this scenario, this, this service that we're waiting for, doesn't exist. Um, yeah, I'm like perplexed as well. But apparently, I think it was a 15 minute 15 minute wait so we've got about another couple of minutes to, to go um, so yeah um, wow it's, it's been a busy it's been a busy week very busy week um, I've been sick for part of it as well which was not the best thing but it happens um, and today, well, this weekend really has been pretty busy. I've been out. No, I didn't do the 159 yesterday. What did I do yesterday? I didn't do anything. Not the 159 anyway. Um, I didn't manage to go to Eastley. Uh, not Eastley. I was supposed to go on up to Bournemouth to get some bits. Um, So, I'm hoping to do that this Tuesday. Uh, I'm off on Friday, off to Didcot and Reading, probably easily on the way back. Um, yeah. So, looking forward to that. Let's just click that. Um, and tr oh, I know what happened yesterday. DTG published another Train Sim World video. It's a bit of a laugh, really. Well, it was not a laugh, but um, oh, I've just seen a little bit of. Right, so we're still waiting. Um, there's been a little bit of uh, details released on um, Train Sim World. There's a new video been released, only short, nothing spectacular. Looks nice because it's probably been done on a top end PC. Um, I have to say the the Great Western Express line looks really nice, but I can't really see that being upgraded. So yeah, right. New ways to play. Oh, by the looks of it, we've got a green. So, I'm just going to pause this here. New ways to play. Oh, who's this? Hello. Hi, Wings, sis. How you doing? Um, I'm not doing too bad. Uh, I could be better. Um... Right, I'm just going through the uh, Train Sim World gump that they've posted. Uh, journeys, the new way to play. Journeys are are your new way to experience Train Sim World. Instead of completing the odd training module scenario or timetabled service, with little to no clue as to what you do next, journeys give you that structure to follow and progress your skills as a driver on a particular route locomotive. Each journey is broken, in, uh, broken up into chapters, and each chapter is focused on a specific aspect of each route. Let's take a look at the main Spessart's Barnes journey and example. I'll tell you what. I'm going to save that there. And, hopefully, if I go there, quit back to the main menu... I 
I might be able to access this from the menu. Dorset Rail, how are you? Yes, it is cooler. It's a lot cooler, actually, which is really good. Um, let me just come out of here a second. Dovetail Live. There we go. Which one is it? Is it that one? Yes, 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 yes. Right, okay, so you can see it on here. Um, right, talking about journeys, this main special up barns. On the new journey screen, <laughs> Dorset Rail Enthusiast. I can't. Oh. It's familiar. I don't. I, it's not definitely not Ben. It's um. Yeah. It Ben, just train that uh, whatever it is. <laughs> Donut. <laughs> right. So each journey is broken into chapters, and the chapter is focused on a specific aspect of each route. How are you doing, Ben? Right, on the new journey screen, the continue current journey button will take you to the first uncompleted training module, scenario or service. And the main Spessart Barn journey takes us to various chapters in this case. There are five. No, I changed my account name. This is genuinely me. Tis Ben. I'm alright, you. Yeah, I'm fine. I'm fine, mate. I'm fine. Um, as you can see, each chapter focuses on something unique to be that driving the DBBR1462 or the cab car or banking in the BR1852. And in each chapter, you can see a list of duties waiting to be completed. If you have already completed some of the duties, they will already be marked as complete. And you can complete these chapters and tasks in any order you wish as well as the, as, as the suggested one. Okay. Take on new challenges. Yeah, I'm good, mate. I'm good. I'm a little bit knackered today. You German trains, yeah. Um, they're not bad, mate. They're not bad. They're not bad. Don't knock the route, because I, 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 the main Spessart barn and Ruhr Sig line, which we'll be doing later, are quite good routes. Um, take on new challenges. Once you start completing scenarios and timetabled services, you'll want to know how well you did and how you can improve. Action points. Um, we've overhauled the way scoring works in Train Sim World. With our new action point system, you'll be rewarded with a set of points for completing tasks and driving by the rules of the railway, depending on your final score at the end of a scenario or service, you'll be awarded with a bronze, silver or gold medal, which indicates how well you undertook your duties. So I think that's a little bit like um, what it is at the moment with Train Sim. I think. Correct me if I'm wrong. Um, the debris screen is now bulked out with even more info. Not only will there be a breakdown of your attained action points but you'll also be presented with a graph that shows how well you performed against the various speed limits on the routes additionally a breakdown of how on time you were how accurate your stopping was will also be presented to you so you can see where you still have to master so mine will be shit then <laughs> um what is it? So basically, all it all it is, right, is just an update to 2020 with the um, with the new GUI, the new graphical user interface. You have the option if you download the digital ver, if you buy the digital downloadable version of Trains in World 2020, you get the new um, West Coast route. I mean, your collection, with Train Sim World, we're refreshing a collection of engaging routes that are included. Rapid Transit and NEC New York shall depart and become standalone add-ons. Meanwhile, the new collection shall be Great Western Express. Do they mention anything about updating it? Extra scenarios? Yeah. Yeah, which most people have fucking got anyway. Oh, shit, I Apparently, I'm not allowed to swear. Apparently, YouTube, you're not allowed to swear now, apparently. Fudge. I said fudge, YouTube, right? 
There'd be some little bloke coming along saying censored in a minute. Long Island Railroad, which was DLC, um, but that's coming on as well as Great Western Express. Main Speset Barn, which is a very good route. Northern Trans Pennine, again, I like that route. It is very good. I'm getting a bit of a shine for it. Um, and then you got the Train Sim World 2020 will launch August 15th. And we'll have a digital deluxe edition that includes our all new USA route, which you're going to have to buy anyway as a um, piece of DLC if you just go for the update. San Francisco to San Jose. Um, so basically, it's not much really when you come to think of it. Yeah, I've seen the video. I don't really think much of it, to be honest. The HST's glitched as well. About 26 seconds into the video, I think it is. Um, right, so they put this up twice. Why have they put it up twice? Because they're boners, basically. Or did I just press that one twice? And not the other one. Hold on. Yeah, so it's the same. So to be honest, I don't know. I really don't know. Um, God, those 40s look nice. The freight over the Pennines. That's nice. I like that. Um, okay, shall we carry on where we where we left off then? Ben's watching me basically because he needs. He, he, he says I need to learn how to drive the 37s properly, and apparently that's with plenty of thrash. Tractors. Tonight's drink is sponsored by. It's not sponsored by YouTube. Don't worry. Don't get upset. It's um, Robinson's Orange and Mango Fruit Sensations. With a kickback of um, Glassu Smart Water. And I'm not getting paid for anything of that. I learned. <laughs> so as long as enough dive. So as long. Hey, eh? tractors. So as long enough. Done that one. Hey, what? So basically. I think everyone sort of talk, thought, sort of thought, as soon as they saw the Great Western Express, they thought, "Ooh, have they updated that to Reading with its all overhead power and everything?" But I think it's going to be, "Oh, are we getting extra scenarios as well?" No. So um, it's just a content up. It's just a content change around and a, a graphical user interface update, basically. Right. By the looks of it, all set, ready to go. I think. Please let me know if I'm doing this right, Ben. God, that horn is so crap. Yeah, it's the one with all the like units sort of thing that horn is rubbish yeah it's rubbish right headlights Hi Ben. Can't do the high tone on the R3. Right, shall we go? Um, got to stop in 163 yards.
you pre-ordered it. Okay. Right, so we got a green. I don't know where we're going. No, um, not yet, no. Where are we actually going? We got no task on. Okay. Ben, tractor's mesh. A couple of grunts as well, mesh. Yeah. Same here, I'll do the update. I mean, the only route I need is the NYC one, which I don't really... I'm not really bothered about. So if you buy the digital download... I think you get the NYC route free. But if you just do the update, you get it as a special discounted version, I think. Yeah, Long Island. Should wire the play seat up for a little bit of a, so it just gently vibrates when you start accelerating. Train Sim 2019. Messing with the G 
GSMR as well. Did you get the 73 today, Ben? Keep forgetting that as well, uh, locos. they weren't expecting me to carry on with this bit of the service. Okay, an error has occurred in the following application, Train Sim World, checking error status. 